starts to get tricky because the snow covers up all these big rocks. Pardon me for driving like a wuss through this section, but uh, it's a long ways down, guys. Long ways down. That'll work. Today we're taking this Dunlop Trail Max Mission Tire up into those treacherous situations to see what we can do to really affirm the 50-50 nature of this tire. My goal today is to be able to get these tires up those same roads that we normally traverse in dry and, well, even wet weather, but in nicer conditions, I should say. Right there, there's snow on top of dirt that we're very familiar with that probably is more like mud right now. So we're gonna go do it. We're headed right there to the hills. So stay tuned. Man, I hate that. So I had a really awesome shot, or a view, I should say, of this mountain range and that one over there. It was about a mile and a half down the freeway that way. I thought that maybe when I got to this section, I would have a better vantage point. But now the clouds are all sitting in front of the beautiful snow-capped mountains that I saw over there. Did you hate that? When you don't take just a minute to pull off the side of the road and get that shot, thinking, oh, dude, I'll be able to get it right up the road. And then you get right up the road, and this is what you have. A big wall of brown mountains. Sucks. Oh, chain conditions. So this is where they're making everybody stop to chain up up here. We're gonna go ahead and skate around this. want to go through right over there. I don't know if this is going to work or not, but we are going to give it our best shot. So cool, dude. Look at this winter wonderland. I gotta remove my glasses. All right, guys, I don't have anti-fog for my glasses. You can see they're already fogging up. So I'm gonna go ahead and take those off so I can see where I'm going. Now what I'd like you to do is go take a quick look at the Anarchy Adventure tire that we did. I actually rode that tire in the snow. And I gotta say that that snow was not as bad as the snow that I'm currently sitting in right now. And I was really struggling on that tire. So we were able to find some snow up here in the mountains. It's about six inches thick. hypothesis in the snow was pretty correct I and mean, these things got snow packed up in them and they really just didn't want to go um, I was able to get through the section I needed to get through but it was a really big struggle conversely I also had the Bridgestone AX 41 out in the snow that was probably comparable to what I'm riding in right now that tire did really well but that is a true they're calling it a 60 40 60 percent dirt 40 percent street It has full on huge lugs. This tire doesn't have that type of lug and that's really what's making us doubt whether this thing's a 50-50 tire or whether it's an 80-20 tire, 80 street and 20 dirt. This is kind of an interesting situation. It's like on most of the things that I've tested, it's like, oh yeah, we're gonna go out and see what this is gonna do. But with these tires, every time I have them out and I go through a situation with them, I end up like, why? Why am I trying so hard to make this tire fail? That's just an interesting question. 
It's like any 50-50 tire that has a full knob on it. We just say, oh, it's a 50-50 tire. We're going to go out and test it. It does okay here. It doesn't do okay there. This one here, they said it's a 50-50 tire. We're like, bullshit. Look at that thing. And now we're doing everything we can do in order to make it not be a 50-50 tire. Um, and that's kind of a funny thing, I think. So anyway, right now we're going to be testing this tire on this snowy trail. Good morning and happy Black Friday to all of you. Take a look. For those of you who are skeptical about the 50-50 nature of the Dunlop Trailmax Mission Tire, I'm going to go ahead and uh, set the camera up. Take a look at this. We got like six inches of snow here. This tire does a pretty damn good job. I'm trying to get the camera to be able to stay in the position that you'll be able to see. Come on guys, work with me here. I don't think it's going to work. All right, now I'm going to show you what this uh, Trail Max Mission tire is doing. Is the camera moving? Is it shifting? All right, hopefully it stays. Take a look. Now take a look at the ground we just tore up right here. This is it. It may not have huge knobs like a TKC80 or a Motaz or any of the others. It's actually doing a damn good job out here. There's no other 80-20 tire I've ever ridden that would be able to handle this. There's a lot of 50-50 tires that would struggle as well. Anyway, happy Black Friday. Thanks for watching. See you guys on the flip side. Alright guys, quick shameless shout out to Climb. Dude, this Hardinger suit is primo. Cryos Pro helmet, amazing. Power cross gloves, the best Gore-Tex glove that you can buy for $99. That's going to keep you warm and dry. Now the suit, it's like $1,200, but it's well worth it. Single piece, you jump in, zip it up, and you're waterproof. You have D3O protection, and it's easy to get in and out of. It's got like, I can't remember, 14 vents. It has ridiculous amounts of vents. So I've been this thing in Death Valley in the summertime and it still worked. So here it is. 32 degrees up here in the mountains in the snow. Having an awesome time out here on this adventure bike. Tearing up some Dunlop tires. But just want to say thank you, Climb, for keeping me warm and dry and comfortable. You guys freaking rock. And now it's time for snow for Angel. Snow Angel. Let's see what it looks like. Is it a good one? Oh yeah. Nice. All right, now that shameless plug's over, it's time to get back to work. All right, well now we're coming down from the mountain and I gotta say that these Dunlop Trail Max Mission tires, oh, look at this. Somebody lost the whole boatload of snow. <laughs> it's funny. I gotta say, these Dunlop Trail Max Mission tires are really a 50-50 tire. I mean, sometimes you can't judge a book by its cover. There have been some knobby tires that I thought would be amazing, and then they perform lackluster. I mean, they get packed with mud, and the mud doesn't fling out, and they just are okay, but they're not amazing. What do you think? Wet, muddy hill climb? Let's give it a shot. Now these tires, looking at them, like I said, I would have thought that potentially Dunlop were a little aggressive when they called it a 50-50, and it was probably more of an 80-20, but man, everything that I throw at this tire, it actually does a really good job at. Um, if there was one thing that I think it could do better at, and that would be wet weather traction, um, the harder rubber compound that they use in order to be able to get longevity out of this tire, Yesterday, without trash control, without ABS, I was sliding quite a ways um, when I came to stop lights and stop signs. And that would be the only, the only thing that I would say that this tire could do better. Now look at the line of cars all waiting because they got to get chains on before they go up the mountain. That is a miserable mess right there. I mean, look at this. This thing is miles 
long. You got people outside of their cars talking to other cars. <laughs> anyway, Dunlop Trio Max Mission Tire. Anyhow, that's it. I'm Carl Bradshaw. Thank you for watching. Till next time, take care and ride safe.